Greetings and salutations, I'm Keb. Welcome back to this let's play of Imperialism as the nation of Phoenix. Where we are in a bit of a pickle. We've <laughs> yeah, I don't know if this is gonna work out, but we have to keep trying. Hopefully his artillery will be so weak that we can actually destroy it. Um, first things first, we're gonna need six units for that. For that. Nine units for that, that's 15 ships for this. Uh, so we need at least 15 ships saved over. We do want some wool. We do want some timber. Uh, now we need to save the ships for the coal and the iron. Oh, I missed by one, uh, though. Okay, we're gonna attack. Auto deploy. Yeah, this is gonna hurt. And this terrain is awful. Uh, okay, move closer. We're gonna need to assault in one rather big and ballsy move here. Uh, no, don't move. Okay. So if I attack, he's undoubtedly gonna hit me. And destroy me. Probably. And move one closer. And like so. He isn't moving still. Yeah, he took both hits. Now I have to move in and attack and kill those artillery. That's our only hope, really. That is our only hope. We killed one, actually. Um, are we close enough? No? Okay, one more. Are we close enough now, please? Yes. Okay. And that means he got so badly damaged, he's actually dead. So now... Now the infantry are gonna not counterattack. Uh, that was unexpected. I would have been almost certain he would have counterattacked. Okay, that artillery is not gonna be destroyed. That's good. Now let's see if we can hurt, possibly destroy another one. No, we couldn't, but we did definitely hurt it. And Garrison is being attacked, yes, because he's trying to reinforce. Deploy the troops, and he immediately withdraws. Which is a very good sign for us. Let's see if we can at least damage him for daring to mess with us. Are we close enough? No? Please tell me you can fire that one. No. Lost it. Oh, we didn't ret retreat far enough. Oh, that's very good. Chase him down. Chase him down. Kill! Ah. Uh, so we can't hit the upper one. Please tell me you can hit the upper one. Yes, but you can't actually kill it. Ah, very bad. We managed to retreat both of them. They got badly damaged, but they didn't die. So let's see, victory at sea. Ah, we sank a ship of the line. Very nice. Or is it a frigate? No, it's ship of the line. SL, ship of the line, yeah. And we intercepted some merchants. We captured a trader. We sank an Indiaman. And of course the province there. Oh, very good. And the blockade is starting to take effect. And we gain one unit, yes. Yes, I know. Uh, I know there are better techs out there and I can't do anything about it. Yeah, I'm gonna build a depot there so we can secure the gold, secure our income, as long as we don't lose the province. Yeah, which we could. Oh, oops. Um, which we easily could. Could easily attack me. Yeah, you're gonna stay there for now. You are now badly damaged. Ugh. Stay there and protect. 
one unit of artillery. He is no longer... Ah, where are you going now? I know you know. Let's... Where are you going now? So let's see here. That's our fleet. Warship of unknown type. Join the blockade. Um, beachhead report. Yeah, so now it's trying to make a beachhead in the other province. Um, so the troops here... I'm gonna move to this province. To defend. They still aren't blockading the ships out there, that's good. We can make more steel, that's very good. Now we're gonna need to recruit at least two more. We need to grow. Uh, we probably don't need more timber. Because I kind of want to build more ships. We have enough timber, but not enough guns. Uh, we don't have enough guns. We can build two more frigates. really want more commerce traders, so I'm gonna build one more of those. Even though I could build two frigates instead. I really want more heavy ships before I start engaging their main fleets. Uh, that's not gonna happen this turn, not gonna happen next turn either. Yeah, if I build that, I'm not gonna be able to build that next turn. Because I won't have enough artillery. Maybe I should No, I want the Commerce Raider. I want that ship. I want it, and I want it now. Excellent military. Yeah, damn well hope so. I just hope I can actually exploit it. Ah. We can try to make peace with Sim. I'll try Ordune first. Very much doubt Audion would be interested in that, but you never know. They're the weakest military target. I wish I had waited. So if I hadn't attacked him, he would probably have been dogpiled, like I am currently being. Ah, ah well. So the problem now is that they might invade down here, but at least our forces are now in this province. Most of them. Um, yeah, that extra cannon. I probably want to redeploy that with the battle fleet, battle army. Those are going to stay there for defense. I think two artillery should be enough to help along with the infantrymen. That's the problem with these. When you invade, it takes a while for the militia to recuperate. Hmm. Ah, ah. I'm changing my mind again. Um, okay. One less textile. Build another frigate. Next turn we should have five guns, we'll build a ship of the line. And with that we might be able to do something about all the ships down here. We're not at war with the Neb, so they shouldn't be a problem for us. I'm kind of fearful of sailing too far away from our home port, because suddenly they'll be here and then we will be in trouble. Uh, one warship of unknown type there. 
And they have some they have some of their ships down here, so one raider. Unknown type, unknown yeah. Look at that, it's the weaker power that's there. And two warships, Audion is sailing somewhere else. Yeah, I don't know. Well, if we keep trying this, uh, they won't be invading here anymore. No beachheads. So, yeah. Right now, those four provinces and that one are under attack, you could say. Hmm. There's still no way for me to shorten the frontier here, either. The front line. The only thing I could do is just smash up and take the Zim capital. It, that's gonna be tough. Not something I'm gonna embark upon. Uh, we're gonna need more. Uh, how much coal are we gonna get? Nine units of coal. Six, seven, eight, nine. Yes. So why do I always count the strong? It says fi that's fifteen total. Does it mean nobody else are buying these? Huh. I don't know. Can get the wool. That's what, how we're making our money right now. Um, take that. Yet only four units because I seem to be making a counting error here every single time. So yeah, okay, there we go. And this turn, warships defeated. Defeated. Ouch. Okay, so two of my frigates. They didn't join up. Oh, that's my mistake. And then the other sank that one. Oh, okay. Yeah. I sent them in two separate fleets. Ah, uh, doe. Well, that was unfortunate. So we lost two frigates because of my stupidity. Let's see. We captured an Indiaman. And he has ships escorting, apparently. We interrupted another trade. We interrupted more trades. More in interruptions. And they decided to go pirating are there. Just an interruption. They didn't sink it or anything. Yeah. And one more frigate. Audio in just not one piece. Ah. He's here. Um, grab the iron. Hmm. <sighs> yeah, what to do with you, buddy? What to do with you? I suppose there. His areas are undefended, so he uh, is the one I want to attack, but I can't really afford it. He's a bit too strong still. And yeah, I want my units to be properly defended. You're gonna stay there because he's still trying to invade us. Ah, you just stay at port and escort. Ah. What's the damage on here? One frigate, that's damaged. Uh, keep trying to blockade, see if we can force him to become friendly. <laughs> yeah, we're gonna need... Oh, we don't have paper. Whoops. Ah... Uh. Whoops, indeed. Uh, we should have enough guns for a ship of the line. So definitely going to make one of those. And then we're going to try to save up guns for more commerce raiders. And yes, I am focusing on navy right now because... I'm almost certain that's going to be the one thing that's going to save us here. I believe we have enough artillery and such to just hold the line. 
I'm trying to make a little bit of that too. I might have to make infantry just because that's more efficient in terms of armament usage. Just to get more bodies, so to speak. Um. Yeah. Range of 11. Ugh, ugly. Ugly to fight, at least. They're not that useful in attacking. Range of... Th oh, they have a range of 5. So these you pretty much have to get all into, into the enemy's face in order to actually do anything. They're very mobile, though. I should make some cuirassiers instead of artillery units. They take more manpower though. And these I can make for much cheaper, but they have very little firepower. And these guys have a lot more firepower than even our, like artillery. So once the enemy is broken, these aren't better. Uh, yeah, I might have to consider that next turn. Still, not next turn. Turn after that again. Uh. Yeah. So let's see here. Next turn, what do I want next turn? What do I have right now? I have no guns. Uh, one in the tim uh, one in the timber. Lots of coal. We're going to have uh, three units of guns. So we're not going to be able to do much of anything. We're probably going to make a commerce raider next turn. If I have enough timber. Six timber, yeah. Okay. That's the plan then. Next turn, one commerce raider. And, we, and we're going to recruit more people. And I'm going to keep stockpiling coal because I just want a coal reserve. Um, yeah, your military is now even less. Less dangerous to us. Uh. Paragon is the weakest one, but... Uh, let's try off a piece to Sim. If he's willing to take that, that'll ease our front, and I can always attack him again later when I'm ready for it. Uh, and I've already gimped him pretty badly by taking this province from him. My goodness. All the timber, all the gold, gold, iron, yeah. Lots and lots of lovely resources. Not that we can really take advantage of it. Yeah, we'd have to take some coastal province like this one to do that. Hmm. And I want our fleet to go down here and try to fight whatever is down here, but yeah, I kind of need to build it up first. Losing those two frigates, that sucked. But it was my own fault, I should have grouped up the ships in the same army first, same navy first. Oh well, done is done. Yeah, we just try to get as much resources as possible. Uh... No more. Let's keep it for the coal. Oh, oh, uh, wait for the iron. Okay. We intercepted, just interrupted one trade. Okay. Nothing else happened. Hey! 
Gotyev has become an industrialist city. And to make matters worse... Uh, yeah, the Neb joins the... <laughs> because why not? Oh, joy. So now I'm at war with five of the six of the nations. <laughs> yeah. Uh. I'm really not so, so sure how I'm going to dig myself out of this mess. I really do not know how I'm going to do that. It's only a matter of time before the last one decides to jump in as well, I guess. Okay, train two more of those. Train two more of those. We wanted to make a commerce raider because that's what we had guns for. We didn't have the timber. Yeah, right, we still need to cut that down. So yeah, I'm gonna focus on building my navy. I really have to do that. I mean, the army is nice and all, and I'm probably gonna make a few more cruisers, maybe some artillery, maybe. For the most part, what we have has to just yeah, we have to just plow everything into shipping. Big bad ships. Our industry is fair compared to theirs, yeah, to be expected. So now the Neb decides to attack us as well. Because why not? That leaves only Devron, who are in another war, so they might not go for it. Ah. Just do that. Oh, well, this is bad. Well, this is worse. So we've got one that's trying to create beach right there, and two ships that are trying to do the same here. Ugh. Okay, you are gonna have to move there. Do I have the capacity to move anyone else? Those two units. Yeah, there we go. And you are going to stay up there. Hmm. Yeah, I don't have much confidence in this game anymore. <laughs> I might have just screwed myself completely by attacking that little nation early. Yeah. <laughs> And we'll keep trying. Once I have a few more ships on the line or something, I'm probably gonna try to clear out the raiding nest down here. How many ships have I built here now? One ship on the line, one frigate. We're building one commerce raider this turn. Yeah. yeah I'm gonna blockade one more turn and then we'll probably meet up the fleet and we'll see what we can do. I don't know if we have the strength for it. One raider, one ship of the line, one raider, few in number, yeah. Ah. Keep buying in case we get completely walled in and we still have money so that's not an issue. Okay, what happened? We intercepted some merchants. We captured uh, two of his ships. That's good. That was intercepted. 
seized a steel and captured an Indian man. Ah, that's what we've been hoping for. A free ship of the line. Loki submits to the neb. Yeah. So they became a colony. And that also means they're at war with us. Okay, now this one is secured. I think we can't really lose that. I probably should try to connect uh, this one. My goodness, that would also allow us to get at that access to that iron. Uh, it's a very uncertain front line, though. And it wouldn't be across the ship. I'm gonna wait for that for now. I think... I've been thinking, do I want fortifications here? Forts don't add anything other than defense, and yeah, I'm not sure that's going to help us, as long as we're defending. Um, they stopped attacking this one, good. I think I'm going to go back here and do the whole railroading up here and then we're gonna go down here and secure these resources because they won't be blockaded and by the looks of it they're not landing troops here anymore um, so you can send these back probably there just if he's the largest military power I want to have some defenses against him um, you stay there <clears throat> yeah, that's on your fleet. We are gonna go and join that one. And next turn we're just gonna punch them up and see if we can hit him one more time. And maybe we shouldn't. No, wait. Cancel that. Um, what's the length of this fleet? Can you go all the way there? You can. Well, that, that, that's... Oh, not that fleet. Uh, the blockade fleet. Cancel. Can you go to this sea zone? Actually, go, go home. Because then I know you'll be in one group. And right now, that's kind of valuable. Um, do we want more ships now? We have four guns. I can make... No, I can make one raider at least. Okay, I'm gonna do that. I'm gonna make one commerce raider. That leaves us with one gun. So I can train a cursor, Which I'm gonna do. And I'm gonna educate you up to the proper level. Um, we don't need more paper then. Uh, we're gonna need just focus on text that'll well, stuff that'll give us more ships. More ships! Uh, our income is suffering a tiny bit, that's to be expected. But we have, we have secured quite a few extra ships by raiding. Extra trading ships by raiding the enemy. <coughs> and that's a good thing. Now we don't need timber. That's what he's telling us. I don't believe him. Yeah, it is very unlikely that any of them will ever sue for peace. I'm listed at excellent military, but so that's good, I suppose. But and let's see. Then I who submits. Yeah, Loki. That was to be expected, so I'm at war with Loki too. Yeah. So this is just gonna keep going. This war. Keep, gonna keep growing. 
the good thing is that I think, at least, I think they won't declare war on other minor nations while they're at war with me. <sighs> yeah. Okay, we're going to group up our navy, and then we're going to try to see if we can deal with the ships down here. Kind of doubt that's going to be possible, but we'll have to try. Other than that, we are defending as best we can. Now, come to think of it, don't deploy here. I probably want to protect this one more than that one. If this one's lost, at least we can counterattack relatively easily. And I would like to take this province, but unfortunately that is a fort. And that's going to be tough to, to break through. Could move up here to disrupt his lines even further. If we go there, that's going to be undefensible. I really need to smash through to him, but yeah. Uh, we don't need more timber. I don't disagree. At least we have enough ships now. For all of it. And no combats. They were on the short of horses. No, go figure. I believe... Not everything. We have one left. Okay. Buy that one too. And you're gonna go home. And you're gonna build the depot. Let's just make the, make the basic mines. We might have to trade another miner just to get all these goods home. Yeah, you defend up here. Uh, you want curse here, you're gonna go join forces there. What did you... Oh, there we go. Let me join. Uh, you stay there for a second more. Let's see, that's the entirety of our fleet. Now he's here, so we need to go out and see if we can hit them. Two warships of unknown type. A few in number. Four frigates, three ships of the line, four raiders, and an admiral. Decent sized fleet, that. Still not strong enough. Um, more commerce raiders. Because I like them. And one more course here. All the industries are working at full capacity. I'd like to recruit more people, but now I don't think I can. Yeah, I have to just have to focus on the navy. I really have to do that. So that we can have a one size navy that's. One navy that can deter the others significantly. We're starting to lose money. I'd like to start an embassy, but I can't afford it. And there's no way in hell I can get any of these to make peace. Yeah, I know. Uh, try to make peace with them. Won't happen. It won't happen until you really destroy them. That's when they... When you threaten their capital and stuff like that. That's when they finally decide, hey, we want peace. And of course, I could decide to just smash through the, to turn them into anarchy. <sighs> no, not gonna have the strength to do that. Okay, we're gonna have to try this and see if we can secure our home zone at least, because this is dangerous. 
Yeah, I know. Stronger than our defending navy. Yeah, but... Here's the thing. If they're at port, are they considered defending? If they patrol... I can't make them patrol this turn. That's what that irks me. And I don't know if I can make them defend. If I don't do that... They'll be defending, but I don't think they'll actually do much of anything. Ah... Uh. I honestly don't know if they'll attack the blockading fleets if they aren't out here patrolling. So I'm gonna do this and we'll see if I fall flat in my face. Or not. But I will take a short break here. So we'll find out next episode. Thank you for watching and I hope you'll continue to do so.